Thank you for the support. You have an easy pass to three remembrance bosses. Woods, Church, and Peninsula. I did not see the Dan Campbell's Applebee's commercial. Yeah, we need to spend these souls before we lose them. There's, there's a re re remembrance here, right? How how big is this remembrance boss? Is he a, is he a top fiver? So the Elden Ring promo cards are done. The hand drawn mesmer card will probably be done in 2025. Just like this DLC. Barbard only had to wait 15 months for his hand-drawn card one of one from the logo pulley. That is correct. But I put everything I had into it. Speaking of, I, I had to scrub uh, Murphy Ob's VOD the other day because I went into his chat to sub and he's like, hey, uh, don't go and watch the VOD because I just got done ripping you for 20 minutes. I'm like, okay, let me just do that. Up in the Discord. You thought we were gonna forget that? What is that for? Why is that gold? Spirit ashes. Okay, so we're pretty much done with this area. So there's one more remember. There's one more boss in the southern pleases. It was smart advertising, Doctor. You go all the way to the south. -a. Um, Marcellus, is this a top five or is this just a fringe remembrance? Okay. Luann Nebby says there's one mini boss still. Luann. Are you being one guy? Luann, Luann's doubling down. Luann's doubling down. Says there is another mini boss here. Luann, you're that strong? I'm with you. Welcome to Science Streams. If you're interested in all things science in a fun, wholesome environment, you are in the right place. Science is a unique husband and wife team of Valint and Lita, who hold their PhDs in molecular and systems biology from Dartmouth. All right, science fellow comes in, first time chatter, says hello, fellow ambassador. Um, first time chatter. Hold on, let me let me pin the message here. Where did it go? Oh, I missed it. Shoot, where'd it go? Where's their first time message? Cyan streams in with the bright ambassador. Check mark says hello fellow Twitch ambassador. Hello. Let's see what your streams are about. Welcome to Science Streams. If you are interested in all things science in a fun, wholesome environment, you are in the right place. Science is a unique husband and wife team of Belind and Lita, Very who hold cool. their PhDs in molecular and systems biology from Dartmouth. You lost me at molecular, but hey, 
Teaching, teaching everyone science. Nothing wrong with that. Stick around here, I'll teach you a couple things about science too. I'll teach you the science of never giving up. Of when everyone's telling you you can't do something. I'll teach you about that science. Science of BM. Science of horse anatomy. Don't scare away the fellow ambassador. I mean... I, I don't want to fire BM because they're brand new. But there's a part of me that's like... Tomorrow starts BM Timber. And I know I'm not going to be able to say what I want to say tomorrow. So part of me wants to just let it rip. You know? <laughs> Which hole? We go in this hole up here, right? Che019 underscore. So if you could play Big Brother with streamers, who would you be in alliance with? Che? You know what? I respect the heck out of Che. Welcome, brand new I respect the heck out of Che, because here's why. If I say I were to audit Che, say I were to audit Che, Che asked the same questions twice, twice in a row, but with about two hours in between. Let me see if I'm right. <laughs> Don't ever talk to me. Che, 1150. Che, 1328. Chat, I see every chat. I know every person that comes in here. Every person. And if you think I don't know, look at yourself in a mirror and say, Yeah! I know every person. Even if I don't get around to the question, I know who said it. Even if you come in here with a bright, bright, bright check mark that everybody can see and everyone knows it's an ambassador and you want to come in and say, hello, fellow ambassador, I'll give you the tip of the hat. Even if you didn't say it, I still would have given you the tip of the hat. But the fact that you came up with a sparkly badge and you dropped the ambassador, it still makes me say, yeah. All right, let's keep let's keep moving. <laughs> Acknowledge so that's what me. They wanted and they got it. They got it. There's a lot of ways to get it. There's ways you can get the acknowledgement where you get the respect and there's ways you get the acknowledgement and you get the brand equity hit. I am very aware of both. I don't need to say it. You know who you are. You can get you can you can get acknowledgement and plus brand equity. I thought we got to go up in the the white tree. Hey, what's going on? Hey, uh, hey, while you're up. Can I have one of those, um, and drifts, please, my lovely, beautiful wife? Why are you looking at me like that? No, sorry, can I have the, the tea flavored one, please? Thank you. How's it going? You doing okay? You want to say hi or no? <laughs> she got me the grapefruit one. I just I, look. She was up. She was up. I just I was very kind. All right. Let's head south here. 
We gotta go up there, right? That that was that was asked for, chat. Sally on a bike, your brand equity's in a place you can't really be asking questions like that. You if you if you had three digit brand equity, I'll give you a, I'll give you the best answer. But right now, Sally, your brand equity is like Peloton stock in the dumper. It is. All right. Oh man, these guys are just trying to fly. Let me help them. Still can't fly. All right. So we got to go south here. And everybody say, "Yeah." <laughs> uh, that's not Mega BM. Just so I have a baseline that has to be BM for purposes of, you, I don't think you can't be, I don't think anything done with the ones and zeros in the game can be considered BM. Let's go. That's called harvesting souls. Um, chronically conscious. Thanks for the prime and raging gray three. Thanks for the baker's dozen. I appreciate it. Point down emote is 100% BM. Is that in this game? I don't have it. Wait, speaking of, did we get our souls? Uh, it's only like 50. Full. St. Trina's Disciple Cookbook. Chat, um, Luann has said there's one more mini boss. Is that true? You're here to go down and get the Bonnie first. I'm looking for some some golden sparkles. Looking for some golden sparkles. Not in this area. Where's the golden sparkles? All right. It's in the hole. Got gotcha. you. Do we need the cat talisman? Welcome, brand new subscriber. Kabuki, thanks for the two months of Prime. Appreciate it. <clears throat> cat sensei talisman. Decoy codes, are you really playing rugby? Welcome, brand new subscriber. Yes. I feel like there's a stereotype there. Um, I feel like there's a certain breed of programmers who get to a point where they're like, I need to be ruffling some feathers and they go play rugby. I got a buddy who's a programmer, did the same thing. The only, only person I know that plays rugby is another programmer. I know it's, it's ask, ask how many like new rugby players are out there in the world how many of them are programmers i think you're looking at 91 percent now i'm not talking about like people where 
where like Konal grew up, you know, where rugby is like soccer. I'm talking about where rugby is like extremely bizarre, like the US. They're all programmers. No, oh, snowboarding is snowboarding is way more normy than rugby. Now you're just flexing, decoy. This looks like the Dark Souls one cave. Yo. Valway, thanks for the three months. Rugby is hard to find in the U.S. Well, rugby is not hard to find in the U.S. The demand of anyone who wants to play it or watch it is the part that's hard to find. Where's, where, where's my plus twos at? The only time any American has seen rugby is on Bluey. That's the only, on that like end of like season five of Bluey. Just came in, no idea what you're talking about. Here's a plus two, yo, thank you. Uh... All right, we got till tomorrow. We're gonna do, we're, we're gonna do the bounty tomorrow. Just remind me tomorrow. We're gonna do, we got, we'll watch the movie uh, bounty tomorrow. We'll keep rolling here. Yo, I missed. Have a good one. Speaking of, quick reminder, if you haven't signed up for the three card Marty tournament, exclamation point tournament in chat. The tournament seedings close today, tonight. So get in there. It's a dang packs card game if you don't know what the heck we're talking about. New music, key change. Stone coffin fissure. New area, new us. So this is underneath the underneath map. So we're land this, the DLC is under things betwixt and the fissure is under it, under it. All right, we'll do we'll do some 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 BE here, blind exploration. Marcellus Wallace, pour yourself a martini on me. Vodka, not gin. Holy. Hey, what's up, Kate? <laughs> That's what we're gonna do. The BM Timber right there. Slay it. The pool is gonna be so deep. Not even a single thimble of droplet of water is leaving the pool. This feels like, this feels like good area, man. The music, the ambience. Saint Trina, wasn't she on, um, No Limit Records with Master P? Trina, I'm the baddest bee. Vizzle says, hey, Dan, I'm new here. Doing a no level health up challenge. That is a great question, Vizzle. 
I got something for you. I put this together for you real quick. Edit, edit, edit. Sting, 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 sting. Edit, 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 edit. This is just for you, Vissel. Why do we have any Vig? Great question. Two years ago, we were playing Elden Ring. We were fighting Radon, and one guy in chat came in and said, I bet you can't beat Radon with no Vig. So immediately, we went over, respect at Rolanya, took our Vig down to zero, kept Fia's blessing, and two years later, here we are playing the DLC for the first time with no Vig. Some people may say, Dan, you're playing with no Vig despite chat. I say we're playing no Vig despite one guy in chat. Vissel says, ha, ah, wonderful, dude. Thank you. No, Vissel, thank you for checking it out. This is our first time playing the DLC, and we said, hey, why not make it even harder and put it in the Suffer Core library? I feel like there should be a separate Armin Anderson section for BM Timber so it doesn't end so quickly. I mean, that's not a bad idea. Since when is it BM Timber? Cold Croak, it's going to be a challenge that we do tomorrow, but basically there's going to be a pool of people who are going to put up subs that to be paid at the end of the month and every time I BM is minus one sub for every person that did it. So say 20 people are participating, every time I BM it'll be minus 20 subs. It's going to be a, it's going to be a challenge way harder than this. I can promise you that. Dan, do we actually need to do any of the tech work on that? I think CMO Punk has it covered. Um, Decoy, I really want you more focused on the huge, massive... There's a lot of work to be done with that. You know, Decoy? Yeah. No, thanks for checking. Those guys come back? Who decides what is BM and GM? Chat does. Chat does. Any other any other question on BM Temper? That's good. That's good. So we can we can get everything clarified now so it's very streamlined for tomorrow. It's a great question. What happens when the pool goes negative? Ferminator. I do appreciate your programming mind wondering what will happen if it goes negative. But it's not going to go negative. Why would you think it would go negative? Swedish Mailman. So what happens for the people who don't pay up? Swedish Mailman, as a newish member of the community, that is uh, not a concern of mine. It's more of just having fun and for the people that want to participate, participate. And those that don't. Um, it's all good. Speedrunner start. Lamb diggity dog. First time chatter. Lamb, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna cut you this break. I'm gonna cut you this break right here. I'm gonna cut you this break. Coming in, dropping an emote I've never seen. I'm certainly I'm certainly not going to um, assume they're from your own chat because I, I don't think they are. But I want to learn what that emote is. Actual 364 Gordo LHO. What the heck is that? Why do we 
great question. Two years ago, we were playing Elden Ring. We were fighting Radon, and one guy in chat came in and said, I bet you can't beat Radon with no Vig. So immediately, we went over, we specced at Rolanya, took our Vig down to zero, kept Fia's blessing. Lamb diggity dog, hop in the Discord. Diggity, are you in are you in the Discord? Where's Diggity? I, I have not played the new Dr. Ulcer song yet. I have not played it. Frost Raver says, what's wrong with the coffee shop? Frost Raver, I have one question for you. I noticed you're a new subscriber. Was that gifted? Or was that by your own volition? You bought it because you got Mesmer down, my man. So that means that means you're newish on the channel. Frost Driver, can I ask you a uh, another question, if you don't mind? You were here. I appreciate it. Um, are you currently dating anyone? What's the triple question marks? No, Lamb Diggity, you missed your you missed your chance. Well, I'm trying to find someone to date. I just needed to get from A to Z. The A was asking, what's wrong with coffee dates? The Z was a person who is looking to date someone and is not dating anyone. So that answers the question. So, Frost Raver, if, the, if you need any help in that department, you got a, you got a, a ticket to the Discord whenever you want to. Wait, what's wrong with coffee dates? I mean, this is a... This this is a this is the bedrock of society. What's wrong with coffee dates? I'll give you the long and short of it. Coffee dates are for job interviews and to catch up with a family member, not someone you're trying to. My man. And we'll leave it at that. We don't need to go any further, but let's read some lore here. I abandon here my love. Yeah, we don't need to get into it. If, if you're going on a first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, or tenth date, taking them to get coffee is an instant, one-way, non-refundable, non-returnable ticket to the friend zone. You're never coming out of it.
Dan, I got lunch with my grandma yesterday. Yo, she has a PhD it. in psychology and taught that for the past 50 years. She has a lab named after her. She told me that if I ask someone on a date, I should ask them to get coffee. She has a lab named after her. No, no disrespect here, Zorgox. But are you going to take dating advice from someone who's 110 years old? Do you think you'll beat this DLC before Christmas? Dang horse. Now marriage, yeah. Marriage, I'm like, yeah, man, yeah, Grammy, Grammy. How have you been married? For, I, I, ma you've been married for 75 years? I'm asking Grammy. But guess what? They don't have sock hops anymore. They don't ride around in Model T's and Model A's anymore. So tell your grandma the professor She's got marriage advice. Hop in in the Discord, bud. Or in her case, doctor, bud. But that other stuff, leave it to the experts. Look, chat, we're not we're not going to get in the long and short of it. But you saw the unasked for delivered spin drift. I'm out of my element. I'm out of my league. And so you, you might say to yourself, How's, how did he get out of his league? Let me, let me pick that brain a little bit. All right, that's, that's what I would look at. I look at the brass tacks. I, I, I look at the brass tacks. All right. This is gonna this is gonna be a great message. I already know it's gonna be the best message in all of Elden Ring. Whoever made this, delete Elden Ring from your entire computer. I told you, Chad. I'm getting him in today. Because BM Tumber is the biggest challenge of our life starting tomorrow. I asked my date if I could hold her hand on the next date. Sir Matrix, school just started, man. Eighth grade end of the year dance is in for a while. Write down all your BM in a notebook and release it on October 1st. I mean, I wouldn't mind having, if, if I'm gonna be docked to anywhere between 15 and 25 or even more subs per BM, to have them documented was probably not a bad idea. is this Ew, I've never saw eyes before on those things. Have they always had eyes? Yeah. Are you sure?
Holy. You get out of BM free. Do you get a get out of BM free card for doing something like two BM free BM per show or something? Otherwise you're running out of 30 minutes. I wouldn't mind if, if there are some organic baked in chat challenges to get me a get out of BM free card. But I, I don't think, I think one per show is, is probably egregious. Galleria. Dan, you should have some weekly BM allowance for the month. I mean, I'm open to it, but I what I want to make sure it feels earned. Okay, we're not doing BM captains. It was just gonna be a community vote. Let's go. Dan would never BM a viewer. Why? Oh, look who it is! Look who it is. Good old fashioned Weigel gas. Let's, let's, let's see what Weigel gas has been up to. Weigel. Let's see. Relatively quiet in the discord. Weigel Gas, would you be opposed to me showing your Discord profile picture to everyone? Would that be something that you would be opposed to? Wait. <laughs> I, would, I wouldn't do that without asking you. I wouldn't do that without asking. But then you made me break the fourth wall. You don't get the same kind of consideration? Gek, you got a Cerso's Dungeon video named after you. In terms of brand equity, it doesn't Both get any better than that. There goes all those souls. Every last one of them. Flushed. A Kanala. Thank you for the prime. I appreciate it. All right, we got to be able to get through here. Holy burger. This area is one of the most BM areas of the DLC. It's very sprintable. Hey, uh, Fallout 2X, when you play uh, Souls games, does uh, Tanner... Hey, Tanner, does he go to the bathroom for you, too? One day. I mean, it's going to be a very rare occurrence. One day, I want Small Ant to show up in chat. Me ask Small Ant a Mario question. Someone else in chat answer the Mario question for Tanner, and then I hit this button. Hey Tanner, does he go to the bathroom for you too? Ideally, it would be Point Crow answering the question. That would be a tremendous orchestration. Now that, that would be worth minus 30 subs. Power Up Monster, first time chatter, welcome. Power Up Monster, I know, Power up monster. Let me let me edit, 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 Adobe Photoshop. I made this video just for you, Power. Why do we have any Vic? Great question. Two years ago, we were playing Elden Ring. We were fighting Radon. The and heck one is that? guy in chat came in and said, I bet you can't beat Radon with no Vic. So immediately we went over, respect at Rolania, took our Vic down to zero, kept the as blessing, and two years later. Here we are playing the DLC for the first time with no VIG. Some people may say, Shoot, Dan, you're playing with no VIG despite chat. 
I say we're playing no vig despite. It's not doing us any good here, is it? Where's my shard? All right, let's get this toast. You know what? Why not us? Why not now? Let's make it all the way to the boss without dying. Now let's get there. Let's go. Can you win for me? Fat Catnip, thanks for the 32 months. A Lamau, thanks for the 47. Can I win for you? Win what? Betty Van Halen, that kind of looks like Moyhead Algo. Who is that? Peace Frog says. Watch a Big Brother season 10 video essay. Essay, did you ever consider doing Survivor? I did. I did consider it. All right, let's get this toast. 100% dial, chat. 100% dial. How is it BM to say someone looks like someone else? Why no Survivor then? Because I got cast on Big Brother. BM me BM mean exclamation point BM lasagna lover says you look like the Costco dad no BM by the way I don't look like that guy at all not even close I know I really don't look like I'm Raven. I don't know why people keep saying that. How many booms does this ER section get? What do you mean booms? Are you talking the kind of booms that I think you're talking about? If so, we haven't had those kind of booms in a long time. I don't even know if we have those booms anymore. I don't think we have them. I can check though. I, I don't even know. I, we, did, we would have to go so deep for the booms. I don't know if we have them. I don't have, I don't even know where it is anymore. Wait, 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 wait. Boom, boom, boom. It's been a long time since we heard that one. Baramoto, you found it faster than I did. What will you do when you finally beat the DLC? Peace Frog! That's what I'm talking about. Brand new chatter coming in here. Not saying this guy's never gonna win. He's got no chance. He just comes in and says, when you beat it, what's next? You know what I have to say to you, Peace Frog? Just zip that yap, sit back and enjoy the show. Don't worry about what's next. There may not be a next. There may not be a tomorrow. You just never know what the, how life's gonna deal you lemons or lemonade, or you're gonna get a D20 and finally your time's up. So while you're here, just sit back and enjoy it. Cause lemons on sale again. All right.
There's a difference between stranger exchanging pleasantries and a friend telling it how it is. What does that have to do with general admission, Daniel? Lemons are on sale. New chatter gives GM Dan tells him to zip his trap and a lime. You know what? New chatter said zipped. That's how that's the fastest path to VIP I've ever seen. <laughs> All right. Cheetos, I see you clapping. What I need you to do is start looking out for Coco. Coco's been putting a little too much sugar in the waters, if you know what I mean. It's been got a Kokomo's green sword's getting a little buttery. If you know what I mean, like that it may be dropped. Hate for a mod to drop accidentally drop their green sword. You'd hate to see it. I swear the funniest bit ever when you call Jerry's phone and say the phone is dead. First time you did that, all over the keyboard. What, what was funny about it? His phone is dead. I, I've tried, I, I call him once a year. I've called him three times in the past 18 months. Every time, the phone is dead. From Midland, you had a tornado warning yesterday. You in mid Michigan? K9! Where's my Great Lakes loons at? Dow's Stadium? Are you kidding me? A little downtown area in, in the Midland, Michigan area? You, you, you gotta be kidding me. Chat. Look, I, I'm gonna show you something from Midland, but you cannot judge me for it, okay? You promise? Okay. Because it's a parent, I don't like being judged about parenting things. Everything else I'm okay with. So, I was in Midland with my with my kids, my wife, this summer, a couple weeks ago, couple couple months ago. So there's like a lot of open green areas and like across from this place, there's a restaurant. So the parents were like, you can like, this is like, literally you can like throw a wiffle ball and hit it. So hold on, let me get out of here first. As long as this Midland, Michigan person still here. Okay, K9, just hang with me for a sec. All right. All right, so. So you can't see it, but, but over here, there's like a restaurant on the other side of the street. It's really close. So there's a lot of green spaces, you know, it's, it's, we got a couple families that like, okay, we, we generally bring like a wiffle ball set so the kids can play if they want and run around. Like, cause after about 20 minutes at a restaurant, you either, you know, I don't, no judgment. I don't want to say what I'm saying, but anyways, like they want to, they got, they want to go do something. So the parents are hanging out, they're playing wiffle ball right here. And then out of the corner of my eye, there's like 
green grass behind here. This is a memorial. They took the wiffle ball set over here and they started using this like the green monster and having a home run derby. And some people walked by and came like, and they're young kids, gave them a look and they're like, hey, like, they're using a war memorial as like a home run derby. And they were trying hard. I mean, like maybe like one out of every 50 was a dinger, but they were pogging up and it's like, I was trying to think if I was six, seven or eight years old, would I use that as a great question two years ago? Would I use that as the green monster? I probably would. And then I was wondering, I mean, this is, this is going maybe a little too deep in current events. If I was one of those soldiers, would I be okay with that? And I, I would be laughing. I'd be like, you know what? Let him fly kid. But that's in Midlis Midland, Michigan. <laughs> Deserved. Oh. K9, have you ever seen that? Maybe, maybe you've seen it, never noticed it. Or maybe you just remember it as the... Zaz, like, I... Zaz, are you being faint bunny right now? Or are you being... The Zaz that used to cook. Yeah, once we, we cleared the area once, we don't need to do it again. No, it's... Help me. Cause Lennon's on sale again. How is he still here? That's what the surgeon said to you after they replaced your labrum. And you wouldn't leave because you had the ouchies, Armin. <laughs> Alright, here we go. If you want it, I actually... You know, we had a, we had a, we had a dev meeting last week. Everyone, all the devs were on a voice call. Armin was there. Armin took the time. We're talking about the future of dang packs, different things we're working on. Armin took the time and be like, Hey, you know, I always wanted to tell you this. Uh, I didn't tear my labor in playing pickleball. And in my head, I'm like, Oh, you, you really want to soak up like six people's dev time talking about your labor he's like i tore it playing soccer and i said that's even worse how do you how do you tear an arm muscle when you just use your feet well, all, you're just using your feet that's, i, I would have kept that one to myself armin i don't know how i don't know how but hey Armin found a way. Help me. I think I, I don't think we can strat this. I think we gotta fight our way through. Yell Nats, what's going on? You have you have immunity in chat. But I'm telling you, your name was extremely similar to a big brother poster that was here about like 10 years ago. And we 
just got to take our time here. Yelnet's a Stanley spelled background? Since when? Since holds with Shia LaBeouf? I've never saw that Shia LaBeouf movie. Shia LaBeouf's best movie is Battle at Shaker Heights. It's so good. It was like the key twist. Well, thanks for spoiling holes for me. Chat, what is Shane from The Walking Dead? What has he been up to since he was Shane from The Walking Dead? Holy. Punisher? Let me rephrase that. What, what's something good that Shane from The Walking Dead has been doing since The Walking Dead's over? Thank you. Can we please get some dang pack spam in the chat? <laughs> XXP water. Thank you for the 10 gifted. Appreciate the support. Chad, have you been gifted from double X B water double X? Please use your first dang emoji. Superhero is an instant BM plus two from you. Fruit bad. If you like going to the same content well over and over and over again for slight variations on the same superhero boss, bringing back the same actors to play the same different superheroes because like, hey, we think our audience is like eight years old. They won't notice that Iron Man is now the guy that played Iron Man is now the biggest bad guy in the game. They won't notice that. Like, that's what they think of you. If, the, if you're okay with that's how they think of you, then hey. Just watching the same thing over and over again with the same characters, same bits, same actors. That's fine. Sounds like a Dan stream. What are you talking about? Can you just explain every viewer that watches you? Speaking of that, chat, chat, I don't get, I, chat, online, you know, you know when I get angry? Never. Never get angry. Literally, never get angry. Not, chat, never. You know, like, we, we've had, we've had some of the toughest losses. People come in here, BM. Never. Never get angry. Ever, chat. Never. Tell, tell one time when I tell, tell me one time when I actually got angry and it wasn't a bit. Tell me. I'm gonna tell you this. I'm not I I got angry for the first time. This past weekend. Now, I'm not I'm not I'm not gonna put the person on blast. I'm I'm gonna I'll redact their name. I'll redact their name to protect them. But you want to get me angry? This is this is all you have to do. You talk about you. You talk about you. I read this message and I was like, I had the clip loaded. And I, 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 wa I dropped it and I said, you know, I'm not even gonna fire back. I'm not even gonna fire back. I redacted the person's name. Not a single Dan viewer has a job. I mean, like, I was like, I had so much ammunition. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna rise above. I'm not, I'm not. let's keep this person anonymous. Let's, let's take the high road. But you wanna get me, you can, you can make fun of me all you want in the content. But you don't talk about the community ever. And especially say something that's not true.
I know, Barnabas. That's why it's like... Alright. Let's go. Lemon bean burrito. Thanks for the 29 months. Not to mention, I'm not even gonna call that person out. Not to mention that that person was previously subbed for two months. I'm not, I'm not, not even gonna mention that. I am not even gonna mention that. Ooh. One year already. I remember when we were fighting Mesmer a year ago. I think, I think, it, and that's why, like, I, 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 I emptied, I emptied the BM clip and said I. That's probably someone that probably caught a stray and couldn't handle it, you know? Yeah, we're gonna try to get to a large boss. Tiberius! Where the heck you been? What what even are these guys? Let's get this toast. I was gonna tell you some GM from your weekend you told his girlfriend was your birthday early to share it. You shared some GM. I told my girlfriend it was your birthday earlier and she, and she said, what is he, 35? Go oh, Cheetos, what do you wait? Cheetos. Put a ring on that. That's that's a keeper, man. Cheeto, that's a keeper. What are you waiting for? That's a keeper. I got a stone on order, brother. You get that pickaxe. Get one out of you. Get, start digging at your local park. All right, let's go win this thing. All right, so we're, I, I'm gonna see if there's like a way we can shortcut this because this is tremendous BM. Whoever said this is the biggest BM area in the game, you are not lying. I don't think we can run. Try. I mean, this is. You piece. We're toasted, we're toasted! Blow up, blow up, blow up, blow up. Mommy! <laughs> I want to heal, but I also don't want to get hit. <laughs> oh. How are you alive? I think we can do it. Now, now that I know we can do it, now we can do it. Chad, is saving Private Ryan good? I've never seen that. Need some Streets 112? That's not a bad idea. It's boring out of 10. <laughs> it's boring out of 10. Yummy, yummy, yummy. <laughs> no! All right, here we go, here we go. 
Streets 112, brother. <laughs> <laughs> we can make it <laughs> we can make it let's go prop bet will we make it one step further than the last time i think we can No, I, I didn't say saving Private Ryan's boring. Someone else in chat said it. Said boring out of 10. Cook him. Oh. Probably, it's probably a good time for the next, the latest Dr. Ulcer drop. Dr. Ulcer. All right. No vid, no summons. I don't want the world. Ooh, I'll give up my chain of gold. I'm with, I'm with you. Not, look, not every, not every Dr. Ulcer is a banger, but I, I do have a, I appreciate it nonetheless. I do have a question though, Dr. Ulcer. We got to kill, you don't have the stamina to do this. Watch me. All right. Let's get this one. We can do this. Why not us? Why not now? By the way, thank you guys so much for being here. Appreciate you being here for our premium live suffer core event that only happens. Every two years, you peace. Whether you're brand new or been here, it's a D1. Thank you for watching. You peace. If you're brand new, I encourage you guys to hit the, the follow button. You hit the follow button. There's two things in it for you. Number one, virtual Daniel, V Dan, the VTuber. Us will pop up in the lower right hand corner and number two you'll get not one not two not three but five free emotes Just for flexing your left metatarsal I know Oh, we're gonna do sponsor tomorrow Cheetos Thank you for Welcome, brand new subscribers. Get me, get you. 
Get me, get you. Get me, get you. 23 month Marty. Love the content. 155 hours is insane, by the way. <laughs> Mike, thank you for the 23 and 0. Straight, I appreciate it. Hasn't been 155 hours. This is one of your worst strats ever. What are you even saying? B Goody, first time chatter. Because I had no idea the greatest big brother of all time player streamed on Twitch. B Goody. B Goody, I got a very, very, very important thing to tell you. Be goody. I'm, I'm gonna talk to you. Get in the Discord right now, voice room. Be goody. Hop in the Discord real quick. I'm gonna talk to you. Really? Yeah, I really do. This guy is going to be an issue right there. We're going to we're going to get the shooter on the grassy knoll first. Let's get the let's get the grassy knoll and then we'll be good. Pidgeman is on YouTube. Tidge. Oh, sorry, such he's keeping a low man. I respect the heck out of that. Tidgeman's brand equity is so high, he's starting to get groupies. So he's 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 keeping a low profile right now, man. I respect it. Sorry, Tidge. Take it easy. Fifty-three Y later, and we still haven't finished Elden Ring DLC. Dang. Trident Jacks, thanks for the tier one welcome, and David Eggnog, thank you for the fifty-three months. Appreciate the support. No, no, we're not dying to that. Okay, good start, good start, good start, good start. All right. Sippy, sippy. Xanthos one first time chatter. Welcome in. This runs for you, bud. Help me get down. Get down.
Thank you for the donation. I appreciate your acquiescence. Fruit Bad. Tipped three dollars. Tomorrow's sponsored BM Temba segment is brought to you by none other than IBM. Hop underscore. Bud underscore. Hop underscore. <laughs> Bud underscore. Hop underscore. Bud underscore. Hop underscore. Bud underscore. Hop underscore. Bud underscore. Lennon's on sale again. All right. Welcome, brand new subscriber. Be goody. Thank you for the tier one. Be goody. Be goody is in the Discord, bud. Be goody. What's going on, real quick? Um,. I just want to give a little context. Thank, number one, thank you for subscribing. Number two, thank you for hopping on the Discord. Number three, B Goody came in here as a first time chatter said, hey, I had no idea. Paraphrasing, the goat of Big Brother streamed on Twitch. B, B Goody, I have to yep. ask you one question. Yep. What's that? How did you find the Twitch channel? Um, I have no idea. I was just stumbling through people that were streaming and I seen your name and I said, there's no way this guy streams on Twitch. And then you clicked sure enough, it. I clicked on your face. I seen your face because it looked the same as your key card from Big Brother. And I said, there's no way this dude streams on Twitch. And sure enough. Did um, the, 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 the icon, like the face that you remembered, how, how accurate is it to like modern day, like live right now? Like a pretty accurate, a little bit different. Pretty bang on. I appreciate it. Hey, um, got another question for you. What's that? So, well, maybe it's more of a statement. Are, are you sitting down right now? I am sitting down. Would you be, how, how do you feel after me telling you that I've been streaming on Twitch since December, 2012? Are you serious? I am serious. I had no idea. So you were streaming while you were in the Big Brother house. Right after. Right after, I had no idea. How long have you been watching Twitch? Oh my god. Uh, since 2015, 2016. Wow. Okay, that means I gotta do a much better job. Who are some of your favorite Twitch streamers that you like to watch? I play a lot of Call of Duty, so I guess you can see where that's gonna go. Um, but I do like some of like the new stuff, like Sketch is pretty good. What's up, brother? That man, enjoy him. Nade Shot, those type of guys. Yeah, so you're like, you're like a... Uh like the uh, i would say like normie streamers but like maybe like the most well-known streamers yeah yeah no that's that's awesome man well um be good i just wanted to to bring you on and, and just say thank you for watching and uh welcome on in and we've, we've been looking for you for 12 years and now you're here <laughs> i'm here man i'm here i'm here i appreciate you chad man this is pretty cool no problem thanks for popping in man thanks man have a good day all right see ya Chat, Tijman, I'm glad you're back, man. Oh, we didn't get we didn't get the grassy null. Be goody, thanks for popping in. Tijman interview when? And Tijman is at a different level of brand equity, chat. I don't, I don't, because he's here, I don't want to gas him up too much. I don't want to say he's in the Hall of Fame of brand equity. But Tijman was building brand equity when people are now trying to grow their brand equity. We're still in Pampers. Like back when Arbard was on other sites instead of Twitch TV doing whatever he was doing, Tijman was laying the foundation, man. Tijman never needs an invitation to hop in the Discord. He's got the keys to the Discord.
I mean, I, I don't think having Tijman hop in the Discord is not a hop in the Discord. It's. I, I kind of would like to talk to Tijman about the, the state of the union right now. About how, how, he's, how he's seen things, how they've been evolving over the past 12 months. Didn't Tijman demolish you in PvP? Yeah, but then. See, I don't want to talk about this because then this is what Tijman's going to want to talk about instead of State of the Union. Then it, I took him to the cleaners at 596 Con in Vegas when I smoked him in Mario Kart. So it's a 1-1 it's a one -one situation. what's going on man what's going on Dan what's new uh, you know just, just job stuff nothing crazy you've been busy I know you've been busy I mean I'm still listening it's just yeah I can't exactly just hop out the phone and just start typing while at work I get I'll get funny looks no I, I hey if you do it you're saying it's got to be really worth it like you like you you've been sitting out a lot of zingers i know you have been i mean look i've had i've been blessed to see people pick up the mantle since <laughs> i've been gone speaking of that i mean i don't want to give you my take but i but i would say that you know since you're i would call it your hiatus you know a little little bit of a hiatus you know it's kind of like i don't want to i don't want to gas you up too much but like when roman reigns needed to take a break you know you know he's coming back at some point but anyways nonetheless what's your take on the current state of the community you know the people trying to like like the the mid card people trying to get to the main event what's your take on that i mean you act like i didn't start off as a mid card when i first hopped in there wasn't even a card when you when you started there there, there was there was I yeah, we were backyard wrestling when I started. It's okay. <laughs> These people got to they got to get time to, you know, work on their skills a little. That's all. I got it. Okay. So so you like you enjoy it. You're like, "Hey, I could I could teach these cats a thing or two or like what's your take on it?" Oh, I I love hearing it. I mean, it, it always starts the cuz I remember when I first started doing it, I knew well, at the time I didn't know, but I I probably went a little too far on some of the BM some of the jokes were probably a little not quite Disney, a little past Disney. Fair. But, you know, over time, you go, okay, okay, rain it back, rain it back. Okay, maybe a little, go a little forward. You know, when chat starts giving you the plus twos and not the, you know, the, the sad face, I'm like, okay, all right, all right, all right. This is where, this is where I'm trying to be. Got it. Okay, so, so the aspiring, like, they're at the point now where there's, like, there's people trying to be, like, the next Tidgeman. What What's your best piece of advice for those, you know, that are they're struggling through the brand equity game right now. I mean, I wish I had advice. Like I don't, I don't think I'm special. Like I, just, no one BM it. But you've been through, you've been through the ringer. Like you 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 you've been through the 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 wars, the souls wars, and and you came out on the other side. I mean, look. The wars are how you prove yourself. I, there's no real good advice. You just, you got to work your way through the trenches. And some people, unfortunately, aren't going to make it all the way through. You know, <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I got you. All right, Tijman. I got a question for you. Give me, because I think a lot of people want to know, what are, what are your, because I, th I think this actually could affect the uh, the economy here a little bit. What What's your prediction on how this suffer core wraps up we're talking like deaths like when you think it's gonna happen you know i mean how many more interviews are you gonna do like how many more songs are, like what, what does that have to do with will? anything I'm, I'm just you are like a crazy x factor dan there is it is so difficult to predict you it is crazy what are you talking about? 
You there are times where you will horse like 15 runs in a row, and then this random song that somebody suggests files you in more than any amount of red coins on the line could ever do. I There's no way for, like, there's no proper formula for this. But, you, but you've been through it. This is not your first suffer core journey. Like, people are looking to you as a beacon to, of where to place their money. So, like, people are like, hey, man, these hard-earned dang coins. We're, we're, how are you advising people? But I, I gained my coins from doubting, man. Like, like it's easy to doubt. It's like, because you're, you're going to fail 5,904 times, but then that 5,905th time, it's just like, well, dang. I mean, that's the risk you take. <laughs> I mean, it's like asking the lottery winner how he won. Like, he just put in the numbers and got lucky that time. Yeah, but uh, you know what? That's what I respect about about Tidge is like, he, he, th there is there is some method to his madness, but he's he's you know, he's keeping the special sauce and the Krabby Patties. He's not giving it away. But uh, but Tidge, just 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 for the people, every because uh, some people are like, where's Tidgeman? You know, uh, just just let everyone know everything is all good. What everything's good. Great. Oh yeah. No, I'm like I said, I'm still listening. It's just like I, I used to listen to you when I worked night crews and I would get off around oh, about seven AM my time. Yeah. Which was about when you streamed. Yeah. Now I'm like a normal day walker, so most of the times I'm listening to you I'm like getting into work. So I got you. I don't, I don't have time to, to be in the chat like I used to unless like today where I get a day off. Uh, I, I appreciate now my day off. My, yeah, my day is off. Sorry, my days off are on the weekends now. So, it, like, it's it's a little more tougher to tune in and like actually get to interact with everybody, which is kind of suck. But oh, I got, that's the working life for you. I got you, Tidge. Well, thanks for coming in, man. It's good to hear from you. It's always good to be here, man. It's always good. I'm, I'll I'll be still around in chat. I'll still be around. All right. I got some zingers for you. All right, Tidge. Have a good one. All right, you too. All right, see. You. Chat, I'm going to tell you this right now. And it kind of hit me when I was talking to Tidge. I didn't want to say it with him on there because I don't want to gas him up. But I think I think what, what makes Tidgeman Tidgeman is that he was making moves before the brand, equity, brand equity was a thing. He did it for the love of the game. He, he, he laid the foundation of the game. That's, that's an OG right there, chat. You can tell it's a good stream when a long-time viewer compares it to World War I Trench Warfare. Might as well be watching the movie War Horse here, but what with you, more underscore. What, you, brand new what are you saying? He didn't compare it to war, did he? <laughs> he did? I mean, I had some good battles with Tidge, man. There's some good battles. The best doubter there ever was. <laughs> Don't you can't give them taglines, man. That's too much, man. The best doubter that ever was. Get the heck out of here. Maybe accurate, but we're not calling him that. He could snipe a BM <laughs> 500 yards. <laughs> oh, we're in a Clay Thompson. Now expired Golden State Warriors jersey. We gotta go. Hey. Yo, Cersei's dungeon, what's going on? All right, chat. We, we have to clear. Please tell me there's at least a bonfire on the other side of this. My girlfriend of eight years took me to Chicago to celebrate this past weekend. Celebrate what? Smoke them. What do you mean? Celebrate what?
What are we talking here, bud? Burger after burger. It's a great, great Twitch name. Celebrate your birthday. Down. Go. You peace. Are there any close calls with Discord Hoppins? Yelnats, what do you mean by close calls? What do you mean by close calls? What do you mean? Yelnats, what do you mean by close calls? People saying bad stuff? Hey, hey, Yelnats, you've been around this community for more than a day probably in 99.9 percent of other chats you, you got to worry Should about we that go to chicago underscore to celebrate i don't that that doesn't even cross my mind this is tough man i did i did not like i thought we'd run into some trouble in the bosses the bosses are the easiest part of this game Why isn't the boss death counter going up? This is the worst part of the DLC. What do they call this part? We've been waiting for Dan to get to the lasers cat face. Green bean, why the cat face? Welcome brand new subscriber. Getting that toast, I see. Which by the way, I never thought I'd be in a place where I'd know what the cat face emote would be. No judgment. This is crazy. The cat face is diabolical. How did he get baited here? I mean, you're not wrong. We may have to doom this thing. All right, I'll give you one locked in run here. Dropped my son off for his first day of first grade today. Yo. Was totally cool until he was already in the door. Then cried all the way to the car. He's just so big already man dang hug thanks for the entertainment today. Wait, wait. He was good? That, that almost does make it harder, man. That's a big one though. Hang in here, hang in here, hang in here! Michael! Michael! It's a look back, it's which, you know what? Nap on Pap. Did he not give you the look back? All right, this is the run. I can't even imagine what the, the prop bet should be 5,001 odds here. Your daughter doesn't even let you walk up to her classroom anymore. Does it have anything to do, the, do with the fact that your Twitch name is Shaft Daddy? Just, I'm not reaching, I'm just asking. Now, this is gonna be a very important question. When BM Timber starts tomorrow, would that be considered BM? Why for yes and for no? 
Because that's going to be one that's going to be extremely hard to sit on. I will not be able to not say that. Yes, but worth it? You think it's going to be worth minus 30 subs? Patience, patience, diligence, patience. Hey, patience, patience. Patience, diligence, diligence, patience. No! What was the, uh, what was, was that considered BM or no? Oh, that is down. I don't know why it does that. Um... Are there any devs out there where if I sh if I send you the .exe file, will you know why it does that? Artemis file. Something funny about what I said. Sippy, 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 sippy. Sippy, sippy. All right, chat, last run. Full Metal Alchemist. Welcome, brand new subscriber. Tyler Burnham, thanks for the prime. I appreciate it. I think. Hey, how's Deadlock going, guys? Hey, it's good. Good. It's been hey good, fun. good. Hey, uh, you got the stream on. What monitor is the stream on for you guys? Uh, zero. <laughs> it's a uh, quarter of my third. To subs that's when Tidgeman laid the foundation this dude was so hollow night pilled. This dude. This dude loves so many bugs, he's a taxidermist.
We made some progress, chat. Ba, ba, ba.